The days of traffic accidents bringing parts of Melbourne to a standstill for hours may be coming to an end. New technology is helping crash investigators clear a scene and get drivers moving again in a fraction of the time it used to take. It's just a test and they're just crash dummies, but it's just as shocking. Only slightly less shocking is how an accident in one part of the city can choke many others, especially during peak hours, more so on a freeway or major arterial. But when a road becomes a crime scene, proper investigation takes time. We might close an entire freeway uh, with 1,200 points of measurement. It might take six to eight hours to measure. What can't be measured is the frustration of drivers caught in the backlog. But the economic cost of delays can. I'm talking like every half hour we close at about $5 million in lost economy where freight's not getting delivered, people aren't getting to work and business isn't getting done. But these new three-dimensional laser scanners mean even the most complicated crash scenes can now be captured in just minutes. They take in every detail from every angle, removing irrelevant items to generate a 360-degree recreation. It's millimetre perfect. Crash investigators say the new scanner represents a quantum leap in how they analyse accidents. And when a case goes to court, it means they can walk a judge and a jury through a virtual crash scene exactly as it happened. Clearing the roads is an absolute priority. Gathering evidence for the courts and the coroner is also a priority. So with this equipment, we think we can do both. The scanners cost around $200,000 each, most of it from Vic Roads. Our aim is to halve the amount of time it takes to keep those roads closed after a fatality, and this technology allows us to aspire to that now. And while the scanners can't prevent accidents, what they will do is... cushion the impact on everyone else. Dean Felton, 7 News.